a self-taught artist who says her inspiration comes from above. Paintings that are spiritual, emotional, and created by a 12-year-old prodigy. This painting is called Father Forgive Them. I've completed this painting at the age of nine. Her name is Aki Anna. She picked up the brush when she was just six years old, but the visions, what she calls inspiration from God, started when she was just four. The first time when she came to me, I knew it was real to her what she was saying, and the visions of God and things she had seen, places that she has visited. She began to describe to her mother in great detail her visits to heaven. All the colors were out of this world. There are hundreds of millions of more colors that we don't know yet. And the flowers were crystal clear. Her mother, remarkably, was an atheist. The concept of God never discussed in their home. And I explained to her, you have to believe me, this is a a different way, the, a, um, a way that's so mysterious that God wants me to go through. To four-year-old Aki Anna, God quickly became a part of her daily life and eventually became a part of her family's life too. I think that God knows where he puts our children in each family. Aki Anna describes God as vividly as she paints him. God looks to me like a bowl of light. He's pure. Uh, he's, he's really masculine, he's really strong and big, and, and his eyes are just beautiful. Her talent doesn't stop at her artwork. Only a few months ago, she decided to learn the piano. And is now already composing her own music. But it is her painting that truly captures the incredible spirituality of this young girl. The visions to me, I felt it was like he's explaining himself to me and what he does to this world. She is a self-taught painter and as she grows older her paintings grow more expressive, more colorful, more complex. A girl who armed only with a brush and some paints is determined to capture the essence of her faith and hopefully along the way inspire others to feel the same way. The most important thing in this world is faith. Without faith you cannot communicate with God. It's just so beautiful up there.